hello fan welcome back to the channel guys in today's video i'll be sharing one of my skincare secrets with you guys guys this is working this is for all skin type fair dark person oily skin dry skin like guys this is for everyone okay so but before we go into this video if this is your first time of coming across this channel please do not forget to hit the red button that says subscribe okay so when you hit on the red button what it tells you is to subscribe to all now please i would love for you to you know click on the all so that you will not miss out in all my diy that i will be sharing with you so let's get right into the video so these are some of the ingredients i will be using i'll be showing you some later okay i didn't display everything so yeah i'll be showing you every of the ingredient and i'll be using so the key ingredient to this is our black soap so guys this is juju osu black soap okay you can get this soap in any african store or any beauty supply store i bought this soap at the beauty supply store it's very affordable two dollar and change okay so this is the basic ingredient for this face mask so guys this soap is really good for all skin type okay so guys but the, this soap usually dry out skin so I will be adding a lot of different kind of oil that is good for our skin okay that nourishes our skin which we have the rose hip oil and here I have my vitamin E capsule okay so all this ingredient I'll be showing you is just to help you know retain moisture on the skin because the duty of some black soap dry out the skin so the next thing we'll be needing here is our glycerin and rose water if you have just the glycerin that also work well if you have only the rose water that also work well but yeah i choose to use both the glycerin and the rose water what this does is to keep your skin okay moisturize right so here we have our coconut oil you can use any oil of your choice all the oils i will be showing you you can just feel free to substitute any oil uh, you can add more if you want so what coconut oil does to our skin it softens our skin okay it gives that it it, it brightens our skin it's moisturizes our skin okay so the next ingredient here is our organic olive oil we have our almond oil we have our tea tree oil and we also have our ham oil okay so here i have my grater i will be grating the 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 soap and here i have my spatula that i will be using for mixing and here i have some measuring spoon okay so the next thing we'll do is to grate the soap you can use knife to scrape the quantity but i like to grate it so i'm grating it directly into the the little mixing bowl that i will be using to mix the product so i will grate as much as i want okay to use like i said you can add more of the ingredients you can add less however you want it so guys at this point we are done grating the black soup so i will just go ahead and you know scrape out the excess from the grater come back be with me so here we'll be adding one table it depends on the quantity of black soup or sorry of the face marks you're using that will determine the quantity of ingredient you will be using okay so i added half a teaspoon of grass rain and rose water i also added 
half a teaspoon of coconut oil so i'll be adding like four to five drop of rose hip oil so all this oil i'm adding is to prevent the skin from drying out because what black soap does to the body is to dry out the skin and they work after you know getting rid of those black spots they dry out your skin so adding oil and rose water with glycerin is to help to retain moisture to moisturize your skin to keep your skin soft you know and bright okay so here i'm adding my vitamin c sorry vitamin e capsule so i'll go ahead and add all the oils and i will miss everything to combine Okay guys, take note, if before you apply any product on your skin, your face, use hot water, the one that your skin can tolerate, to wash either your face or your skin, just to open up the pores. So when you open up the pores, you apply the product, that will help the product to work well. It's going to sit into your skin and start doing the magic then after that before you wash it off you use hot water to wash it off then you go ahead and use cold water to close the pores when i mean hot water is not the one that will burn your skin the one that your skin can tolerate so after washing it off then use cold water to wash and close up the pores okay i hope that makes sense Okay guys, so I'm done washing my face. Here is my rose hip facial moisturizer. Okay, so I'm going to be using this oil, okay, to moisturize my face, to prevent my face from drying, just to retain that moisture on my face, okay? So yeah, voila, go ahead and try this face mask. You can as well use it to take your bath. This is really working so well. Okay guys. Thank you for watching. Please ignore all those the paper the way you're seeing. Okay, I mean, it's a